It sounded like an engine failure, didn't it, Larry? Yeah, it did. And when you look at the smoke that's pouring out of the front wheel wells Whoa. and out the back of the car. Fire, too. Yeah, this definitely looks like an engine explosion for Elliott Sadler. Uh, so what this would mean by the 2018 rules, we talked about this being a short race, if it indeed is an engine failure, and that oil trail pretty much tells the tale, he would have to start this race tomorrow at the tail end of the field. Well, Elliot Sadler out of the car. They're moving it now. The team going to diagnose what happened. Any indication, anything that may have led to this? <laughs> no, no, none at all. And we were just talking about that with Johnny and all. Just um, we'll go in there and debrief, but uh, no warning at all. We don't we don't ever have any I issues at all. We got a great I engine department through Hendrick, and we all know that. So we'll just see what happened, what caused it, and put put another engine in, and, and just go from there. You know, we'll lose some practice time, but if, if this is going to happen, I'd rather happen today, Jamie, you know, than tomorrow. So we'll go debrief and see, see what happens. But no warning at all from our side. Obviously, some of your teammates, they like to shift here. Were you shifting and working no, on that at all? No, I hadn't started that yet. <laughs> we were just trying to get the car going. So that's what I was telling him, and we'll look at the tack. And when it kind of popped, I was looking at my gauges, and all that were, was okay. So we'll go debrief and see what happened and, and go from there. Like I said, it's got to be a fluke deal. We hadn't had... Uh, engine problems in three years here so um, you know our, our engine department works hard so nothing those guys did wrong it just it is what it is we'll go fix it and uh, and we'll, we'll, we'll get ready for the next practice.